I love burritos! Ooh, what's going on? Hashtag Burritos Nation. It's your boy Rainbow Warrior here. And oh man, oh man, Sam, I am green eggs and ham. I am super excited for this unboxing. I know I'm being really cringy right now, but this belt unboxing is going to be one for the ages because I am super duper excited about this. This is the most I've been excited for belt unboxing possibly ever. If if not ever, then definitely it's in the top three, five. You guys are probably like Rainbow, you said this every single episode about how excited you are and it's probably the most exciting you've been or every other. But I'm telling you right now, this unboxing, this belt unboxing, I'm not exaggerating at all. It is almost eight months in the making of getting this belt. Let me tell you uh, how it went down. All right, but anyways, guys, and there was reasons for it. Um, let's go ahead and actually open up a little bit while we're doing this. <laughs> we bought this belt on May 16th of this year, 2018. May 16th, 2018. And... I got it from John Barbarossa at a and Belts because they uh, were, are partnered with both WWE and Ring of Honor. This is the Ring of Honor World Heavyweight title of the 2017 new version, as you guys can see in the title. And uh, John Barbarossa shipped out really, really fast. He uh, was, and I, I asked him to ship it out because they don't have the best wraps on the belt. So I shipped it out to um, a really, really well-known uh, re-leather guy that actually makes the real leather and puts it on the belts. To have real, real fine leather. Romeo, An Romeo Anderson is his name. And he's really, really great at re-leathering. Um, I was supposed to get this belt uh, in July. Um, Romeo got the belt in um, on May 12th is when he was able to get the belt to start re-leathering. And unfortunately, some things, personal things happen like that. Where I'm not going to get into details. Because that's his uh, business and stuff like that. But it took... Seven months, uh, and finally the re-leathering is done, and uh, I don't blame him at all. There is some stuff going on with him and and stuff like that, and and just, I've seen his work, though, and I'm super duper excited about this to be getting this belt unboxed right now. We're going to go ahead and get into this now. A re-leathered, it's not just a Ring of Honor 2017 World title. This is a re-leathered title, so I spent the extra money to get the real leather done on this. Super duper excited. This box is heavily taped up, and it looks like there's going to be, oh man, oh man, Sam, I am three things in him, and that I can feel, uh, oh man, super excited for this, I can feel the leather, how soft it is already, oh man, look at that, I am super excited for this, my Ring of Honor World Heavyweight Championship belt that I've been waiting over seven months to get eight months almost <laughs> oh my gosh i'm super duper excited for this we're gonna go and open this up it's the ring of our i think it's the ring of our bag that comes with just the black bag and we're gonna go and open this up my first ring of our belt i do have a tna world heavyweight wildcat belt i have a fondue wwwf classic backland belt i have a fondue big gold belt I have um, TNA X Division belt and an NWA World Heavyweight Championship belt. All this great stuff. Oh man, this leather feels amazing. This leather feels flipping amazing, man. All right, here we go. Let's go and get this bad boy out of here. Oh man, I want to be careful. Don't want to screw anything up because that would be not cool. Oh, I should probably. Oh, yeah, I'm an idiot. All right, so we're going to go and take this bad boy out of here. And carefully take it out. I don't want to mess anything up after waiting this long for this. I did get the red backing like the actual world title has. And yeah, and as you can see, um, uh, about 99% of the bolts are covered up. We do have, looks like it's the nameplate. So he did go ahead and make it to the nameplate you can take out if you really, really want to. So you can switch it out for... Um, a nameplate in the future if I want to do that. Here's the red backing right here. Really, really cool. The bolts covered up and everything like that. Super excited for this. And three, two, one, and bam, baby. The Ring of Honor World Heavyweight Championship. And I'm super excited to have this belt. Oh, man. Look at that. 
Look at that belt right there. The Ring of Honor World Heavyweight title. And just really, really floppy leather by him, as you can see right here. Really, really easy to bend and fold and everything like that. Really, really thick plates. We got the, the thick World Heavyweight Championship plates as well. And just tons of detail. Let's go and go over the detail of the um, stuff, this stuff, stuffs. Got right here. There we go. We got, uh, is that North America after whatever? <laughs> I'm not good with my geography, clearly. Got the Ring of Honor logo right there with some really, really cool detail. Got the Red Jewels Ring of Honor. Got the little nameplate right there as well. World Champion. Oh, man. Ring of Honor. That is pretty darn sick right there. I am really, really digging this belt. Let's go and look at it, what it looks like over the shoulder. Here, floppy, floppy leather. Really cool beans. <sighs> look at that. And once again, sorry about the horrible quality. I am recording this at night time, but yeah. All right. World Heavyweight Championship Ring of Honor World Title. Wish I could do better quality for you guys, because this video is definitely not showing the justice that it should be. Oh, man. Look at that. Look at that bad boy. We got the 2x5 snaps over here, as well as the 2x5 snaps over here as well. And I know a lot of my belts do not fit me. Let's go and check it out to see if this belt fits me right here. And it's looking like it's going to fit. Oh my goodness, Rainbow Warrior. It's got a belt that fits. Not that I don't have belts that don't fit, but it's just <laughs> some of my belts that are not uh, WWE related don't fit. And this belt actually fits me, which is pretty darn cool. All right, so there we go. There it is on the waist right there. Let me back up a little bit right here from my chair. Ring of Honor World Heavyweight Championship. Um, this version, look at those jewels too. I really, really like those jewels. Jewels pop out really, really well. We should actually look at that in a second. <laughs> that is awesome. And um, first held by Dalton Castle and now um, being held by Jay Lethal, a.k.a. Black Machismo. Yeah, cool beans. And yeah, let's actually look at those jewels really close up right there. I don't even know if you guys can see that or not. I'm sorry, you guys, but <laughs> there is my ring of honor and it actually it pops out pretty well the etching is really really well done on this belt by ring of honor uh, like i said the only thing that was not great was the strap which i'm really really happy to have my own strap done by romeo and Anderson. even though it took a while uh and reasons there were good reasons i'm very very happy to have this strap going on right now Let's look at that detail and everything yeah, I just realized this video is going to be horrible with detail, <laughs> but trust me guys, it is an incredibly gorgeous belt, and it, it someday I'll figure out a way to show you guys that with a better quality video. Happy Rusa Day, by the way! Yes, Ring of Honor World Heavyweight Championship. Absolute beaut. Man, I gotta look this to my other belts. Is this my favorite? This may be, in fact, it's, it's up there. It's definitely in the top five. This is my 24th belt. and Or 20, 24th or 25th. I lost count. My 24th or 25th belt. And this is definitely in the top three or top five of my favorite belts. I love my Ring of Honor. It is relettered by um, by Tim Lee and uh, restoned by Louis Peach. Uh, you guys don't know those names, but <laughs> unless you are in the belt group of AJsBelts.com, you guys should go to AJsBelts.com and their Facebook group and a lot of great stuff like that. That's a better angle for this. Really, really am in love with this belt. Re-leathered on real leather. The screws covered up in the back. And even though I was a little surprised seeing that the um, screws for the nameplate were not covered up, but at first I was not too happy about that, but... Now that I'm thinking about it, I do want to someday get someone's uh, name on that as well. So that would be pretty cool too. But anyways guys, love you guys so much. To the poor random little Kyle O'Reilly. Because why not? But anyways guys, love you guys so much. And I'll see all of y'all. Hashtag Bruce Nation. Ooh, later. Welcome to Ring of Honor. Hopefully you guys watch Being the Elite. It's like my favorite YouTube channel. Anyways, love you guys so much. And I love burritos. 
and they're super duper neato. We don't want no ham and cheese. We just want burritos, please. 